AC44 conveyor dish machine. Troubleshooting. Wash pump motor. In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at the wash pump motor. It's making noises, sounding as if it's almost jammed or not moving. We take a look at the current flow through the wash motor contactor. High voltage of main power comes in through the top of the contactor and when the contactor is engaged, power transmits through the contactor to the wash pump motor. Here, to test our voltage, we use a multimeter set on AC voltage, one meter lead to ground, and one meter lead to the top side of L1 of the contactor. We test the voltage at the bottom of the contactor to verify do we have the same voltage coming through the contactor. Here we're looking at L3 that's showing a low voltage of 38.5 volts. We verify that it's all the volts coming out of the bottom of the contactor. This low voltage is what we call single phasing, or we have lost the leg in the three phase. We now use our multimeter, again set to ground, and we test L1, L2, L3. We verify if we lost the leg or are we single phasing coming in through main power. And as you can see, we have also lost the leg here. When this occurs, we shut off the master on off switch and we disconnect main power from the machine by either turning off the disconnect or turning off the circuit breaker. Always make sure that we lock out tag out. Here again using our multimeter set to AC voltage. One meter lead of ground we test L1, L2, and L3 at the main power terminal to verify there is no power coming into the machine. At this point, we must notify the customer that they have lost a hot leg on the three-phase line. Let's take a look at how we're testing this on the machine. Again, we're setting our multimeter to AC voltage. One meter lead goes to ground, and we go to the top side of the wash motor contactor on L1 and we test the output side of the contactor on L1. We are verifying voltage coming through the contactor. The motor must be engaged to be able to test this. Here we're showing on L3 that we have low voltage or we have dropped the leg of the three-phase outlet. We're verifying on the discharge side we have lost the three-phase. When the machine is single phasing, this is a worst case of an unbalanced voltage condition. The motor draws more current from the remaining two supply line at approximately twice the amount. The motor becomes overheated and that damages and windings will shorten the life of the motor. If the overload is working correctly, it should trip protecting the motor and the circuit. Learn more about troubleshooting the AC44 conveyor dish machine by talking to your managers, regional manager, vice president, or contact the training center for more information.